Hey guys, today I'm doing a makeup haul and it is all affordable makeup and I just want to show you guys all the stuff I got because I love getting affordable makeup. I have stuff from three different places. I have stuff from Hush and Colourpop and just from Walmart or your local drugstore. First I'm going to show you guys what I got from Colourpop because I love Colourpop so much. They have such great products and they're all so affordable and I seriously love that company so much. The first thing I got from Colourpop is this ultra matte lip and I got the color Bumble. The first thing I love about this product is the formula definitely because I think honestly the formula is better than Kylie Cosmetics and Anastasia Beverly Hills because both of those like they're not supposed to make your lips cracked but I feel like they always dry out my lips so much and they just feel so uncomfortable but the Colourpop matte lipsticks don't dry out my lips at all and they don't look dry and cracked I really just recommend Colourpop matte lipsticks over really any other matte lip you can get because I didn't even mention they are six dollars only Kylie Cosmetics lip kits are thirty dollars Anastasia is twenty dollars this is only six dollars and it's better than both of them I definitely recommend this I also really love this color it is a perfect like summer color it's more like a strawberry type red and I seriously love it so much you need to buy this matte lipstick the next thing I have from Colourpop is this Super Shot Shadow. I really love these because they just turn out so pigmented. And they're like a cream, not really a powder. Um, these are also only $6 by the way. I got the color Nillionaire and it's seriously the perfect like gold bronzy color. The formula for this practice is just so good. Like you can seriously just put only this on your eye and you're good to go. That's what I've been doing a lot actually. It just comes out so pretty. The next thing I have is this. Inside there are four Colourpop single shadows. This is such a great deal because each shadow is $5 and when you buy four shadows you get this palette for free and you can just put them right in there. And again, the formula on these, they are just so good. They are all so pigmented and they blend out so easily. So this whole palette with these four shades was $20 because I got the palette for free but I think the palette is like seven dollars if you just buy it by itself but i seriously love all these i can swatch them for y'all here are the four shades swatched on my hand um i really really love them all um the two brighter colors are really good for just like standout looks if you want to do them and i really love this gold one because it's duo chrome and you can see like it has like green in it and then the like yellow one is a really good transition shade all these shades are so good and they're so blendable i really really love them i really recommend these shadows i also wanted to swatch the super shot shadow for you guys and again it's the color millionaire see i just take like the littlest swatch and it has like glitter in it too, but you can get the ones without glitter, but I really like this. Next I'm going to show you guys what I got from Hush, and that's like an online website. It has a lot of, well, it actually it's like all affordable makeup, and it's from a bunch of different like companies. I'm going to start with my very favorite thing that I got, and that is this highlighter. And it is called You Glow Girl, and it's by J-Cat Beauty. I also got the color Crystal Sand. This is seriously the best highlighter I have. It is so good. I have been using it now, so I have it right now. Like, you can seriously glow so hard with this. 
I will do a little swatch again. Do you see that? That is glow. If you want to glow, you need that. It is also $9, which, I mean, that's really not expensive at all for a highlighter. I mean, you could get them for cheaper, but for the quality of that, $9 is nothing. I'm in love with that highlighter. I will not stop using it. And I'm about to put some more on right now. Next, I got two pairs of lashes. I did already wear these. They have a little bit of mascara on them, so. But both of these were only $2. This one is from Stardell Lash. And this one is from Casino Professional. Um, when I wore these, I... I think I like them. I haven't tried these yet. I don't know. I've been trying to wear lashes a lot more lately. And for some reason when I'm I'm getting like really dramatic ones and I feel like I look so weird when I wear them. So I really have to go for more natural lashes for some reason. I don't know, but I'm a little scared to try those, but I'm going to soon. Next I have this lip liner that was also $2 I think. And it's from Holy Addiction. Oh, no, it's not. It's from J-Cat Beauty also, like the highlighter. Um, and I also got the shade 212 Light Brown. And I mean, I don't really have much to say about it. It's just like a basic lip liner. I mean, it wasn't anything special. Next I have the LA Girl Pro Concealer. And... There's so many beauty gurus that have just raved about this product, and I don't know how I really do feel about it because, first of all, I got the wrong color. I got creamy beige. I was trying to get a color that was like exactly my skin color, so I could just just put it on and without any foundation. But it's like it's too dark and it's the wrong like undertone for me. So I should have definitely got a different color. But for coverage wise, I think it is good coverage. For actually, I don't remember how much this was. I think it was $2 too. But, so I'm not sure how I exactly feel about it yet. But maybe I'll get a different color and let you know how I feel. Next I have all of my products from Walmart and I have a lot of products from Walmart. I I did not buy all of this at once. Like this is over a period of time I've went to Walmart and got makeup like every time I go to Walmart I get some makeup. So I didn't buy this all at once but over the past like month I'd say I bought all of this makeup. I'm gonna start with these Wet n Wild color icon. Well, one's a blush and one's a bronzer. I've heard a lot of people say stuff about this blush, and well, a lot of people like it, I guess, but I'm not a fan at all. I don't think there's really any color payoff at all, honestly. Like, there's nothing, no color. Okay, maybe a little there, but I really had to dig in. Still, on my hand, there's nothing. So, I don't recommend this. I think it was only like $3, but still. And then the bronzer, again, I don't think there's much color payoff at all. Okay, maybe there's a little. I don't know. I feel like it just disappeared. 
I don't know. I think this was only like four dollars. I don't recommend this either. I probably got actually too light of a color. I don't know. Don't don't listen to me. Next, I have two products from Physicians Formula. Um, first I'll talk about this one. This is the Butter Bronzer, and everyone loves this bronzer. I do love it too. The only thing I accidentally got the light bronzer instead of just the regular bronzer. So it just it's not as much as a bronzer for me as it is like where I set my face where I'm going to contour. I mean it does give a little color payoff for me, but it's just a little too light for me. But it smells so good. So I continue to use it. Also, both of these were $15. Now, this one, I don't know how to even feel about it because, I mean, it's, I think it's supposed, it's called Bronzer Booster. But I feel like this can't be a bronzer because it's seriously, it's like, it's like, highlighter I feel but it's way too dark to be a highlighter so I never use this pretty much also $15 next I have three brushes from elf um, I know this one was three dollars and it is the flawless concealer brush but I use it for highlighter and I think this is the best highlighter brush I've ever had I've been using it non-stop. I definitely recommend this. It is so good. I love it so much. You need this. Only $3. Next, these two are only $1 each. This, the smaller one is Eye Crease Brush, and this one is the Blending Eye Brush. They're both really good, like, for cut creases or just, like, if you're just trying to get small areas and you're doing like complicated looks, they're really good for that. And they're, they are good at blending out too. And they're only $1, so might as well. Next I have two um, liquid eyeliners. Well, actually this one is like, it's called Intense Ink Eyeliner. It, it's from e.l.f. This one is $3. It's felt tip. I do, I mean, it's good for when I'm trying to do like a little wing really fast, but it's really hard to work with if you're going to do like a good wing. So if you're a beginner at wings, I probably don't recommend this. And I don't know, it's only $3, might as well try it out. And then I have the NYX Matte Liquid Liner. And I seriously love this. It is, it's not the easiest to use, but like if you can really do a good wing, it is really nice. And it stays on so good, I think because it's matte. But I went to like a water park and I, I used this and it kind of, it came off a little bit, but it was still there like right on my eye. So, I mean, that's pretty good. I went under the water how many times and it stayed on. So, I definitely recommend this. I don't remember how much it was. I think it was like $5 maybe. But I'm not sure, so don't quote me. Lastly, I have this e.l.f. Baked Highlighter. And it's in the color Moonlight Pearls. I really do like this because it's one of those highlighters that you can use as like a very subtle highlight. But then you can also use it as like a really good highlight. I'll show you. Okay. So like if I just do a little swirl. It's just like a very natural looking highlight. If I get a lot on there and then I spray some flix fix no this is not fix post this is master fix by Maybelline. And you, 
you can really just build this up. And it was it was only three dollars. I definitely recommend this. I just really like this highlighter, especially because it's affordable and you can make it as blinding as you want or you can use it as a natural looking highlight. You can do whatever you want with it and it was only three dollars. Okay guys, that is all for this video. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a thumbs up for more videos if you liked learning about the makeup I got and if I liked it or not. Definitely comment that you liked it because I can make more hauls or just more videos of the makeup I have and makeup I recommend.